you and coffee. Can y'all be cool? Can y'all be like, what we doing, bro? So peep this, right? She's doing her thing. Yeah. You doing your thing. I get that. So I know you still got love for her, bro. Yeah, so peep this, right? You dig what I'm saying? Thank you. So peep this. That's an amazing question. And I'm glad you said that because up until this point, have anybody in this live or yourself ever heard me speak about her at all, good or bad sense? Some people didn't even know that I wasn't fucking with her. This is her going online constantly. Yo, Geechee Gotti is and KP, they did my business wrong. Geechee Gotti and KP tried to set me up to get jumped. Geechee Gotti and KP. But she really feels like that, though, Geechee. But, but watch this, though. Well, I said, I, if she ever joined this live, I would love her to come up so I can, I will say this in front of the world because it's no big deal. It's not that serious to me. It's nothing to say because there's no lie. There's no studio on. You dig what I'm saying? Now, watch this. After the battle, she didn't show up. I go on Hip Hop Is Real. I don't say nothing even about that. You can watch my interview, right, with Hip Hop Is Real. All I say is, man, we'll get the battle done another day, another time. Didn't really give a fuck. Battle didn't happen. A-War got paid in full, went back on his way. We ain't fought you for that. You ain't want to come, you ain't come. But the thing is, when you say the lies, you in fear for your life, you danger, police, all this weird other shit. When it's like, come on, you a grown man, and I know you can really break it down and be like, it makes zero fucking sense. We're talking RX, salute her, love her. Miss Black Diamond, salute them, love them. S4 Finesse, okay, these is three women. Watch the footage back. These women had on heels and dresses. We're in Compton. Not only are we in Compton, we're in Nutty Block. It's going to be a gang of Nutty Blocks in this comment because this is my page as well, right? We're in Nutty Block, not just in Compton in some random warehouse. We're in my hood across the street from the Grannies. You go look at Geechee Gotti do tour in the Grannies on Street Gang. We're literally right across the street. You can walk. We don't got to run there. We don't got to jog. We don't got to drive. We can walk across the street back and forth. We're highly secured with real security and with my homeboys securing everything. My homegirls from my hood is in the building. Everybody's in the building. Ain't nobody finna get touched by nobody in here. You dig what I'm saying? It's like you acting like you talking about a brigade of thousands of people coming. You talking about three women finna overpower a, a million month. We got business in here. You dig what I'm saying? So the, the, so the, so the truth is you got upset because as a man, I told you, because I don't even know about the RX and them. You hit me about another battle rap female and said, oh, oh, she going to be there. I'm going to beat her ass. Blah, 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 blah. Right. She got the screenshots. I'm pretty sure all this. I told her, oh, no, you're not. You're going to do that 100 miles away from the venue somewhere else, or y'all both going to be getting slammed on y'all head and kicked out this venue. You ain't putting no money on this. Yeah. This is my business at the end of the day. Yeah, you my sis. Yeah, I'll fuck with you on some. Yeah, but this my, you, not, you obviously don't got that much respect if you think you finna run up in my place of business and fight some bitches when we paying for all this. Yeah. This and then this is Compton Airport. This ain't just no regular shit. Drake done shot videos there. Why? This is big. This is a big place of business where motherfuckers. So you gonna fuck up? Well, we done just did a deal with these people to do some. Our first time on Twitch. Think you finna show up? And or then no, it's not. Nope. Not, not, so you know what? Don't even show up if you are gonna come on that type of time. That'll save us all that problem. Don't even show up because anybody who come in here gonna understand. They gonna watch battles and do what they do. You feel me? Because if you really got problems with all these people. Y'all handle that? Who goes to battle events to fight? Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? You got 30, you got 30 other days in the month. Fuck 30 other days, nigga. Y'all got each other's social medias. Hey, I'm, I'm, you're in Compton, yeah. I'm in Compton. Hey, the battle is going on right there, but you know what? Let's go down the street to the Carl's Jr. That got nothing to do with battle rap. Me and you meet in the parking lot and fight. Mm. Nobody has to know. Mm. So to me, it's not, and then that's battle rap beef. I'm, we got real beef going on. We're still in Compton. It's still dangerous. Something can go on. We got to secure all these battlers. I got Moon out here, Chef Trez, G-Lo. I got all these people from out of town in my city. We got to make sure motherfuckers is secure on other shit. You dig what I'm saying? So we ain't got time to be worrying about people that's beefing over battles? Where's y'all beef stemming from? Battle rap. Do you even know? I don't even give a fuck. You dig what I'm saying? Because it's women. So what you want me to do? Slap them bitches? I'm not going to put my hands on no women. That's y'all thing. Y'all girls, fight it out. I never seen you get jumped. Y'all fought one-on-one. -on -one, it's over. Your whole cousin was there when y'all fought one-on-one. -on -one. Y'all had a one-on-one -on -one fight. It's women. Y'all do y'all thing. Yeah. Why would I set you? Why would I make you the main event of my car to get you jumped? What do I benefit from that? Make it make sense. You just getting up here talking just to talk because I ain't said nothing. Because I'm busy. I'm getting money. I'm doing my thing. I'm not even... 
I'm like, sis, that's that's the homegirl. Let her do her thing. I don't give a fuck, nigga. I, because at the same time, I'm not stopping nothing you doing. You're not you know? going out your way to make her look I'm bad. I'm not going out your way to make you look bad, but you jumping on platform after platform. Get you got it. He's doing this. And get you got it. Like, what the fuck is you talking about? Because if I've done all that, it's more that I could have really done. Soon as soon as this shit happened and you started going online, Devo hit me. Beasley hit me. What are we doing? Is, is it okay to steal Booker? Oh, Nettie, it's okay to book her. She don't got to fuck with me to get booked. So you could have blackballed them. What? I'm the biggest star on their fucking platform. If I tell anybody I don't fuck with the same way she say, she telling them, oh, I don't want them in the building when I'm around and them, because they not on. I'm the, what? I'm, get, I'm, what? If I said that's about you, you be done. Oh, shit. But do I do that? No, because I'm, I don't stop. I don't care. I want you to survive and live your life, but don't be putting my name because I be with real serious people. When real serious people be seeing these interviews, they tapping in. Yo, what's going on with all this, man? They, it's them, it's they, man, they good. Now, I mean, let them talk. Let them vent, man. That's a woman. She's scorned about whatever she's scorned about. But don't make it seem like you was done wrong by me. You didn't show up. You didn't show up. Nobody hurt you. If you would have showed up and got hurt, then say that. You did what I'm saying? Don't say you was about to get hurt. Them girls doing interviews, they ain't saying nothing crazy at that battle. They know better, too. Not, not to knock on my lung, but they wasn't coming for that, so I can't even say that about them. I wouldn't even get up here and put it like they came for that. Like I said, they had on heels and dresses and shit. Look at the footage. But you know what, though? But, but here's the thing, Geese. The West is thriving right now. Yeah, but she, she is doing her thing. Let her she do, is doing but her but thing. I don't, know, her, I don't even care what the beef is. there any way you could? I don't know. But, it's weird but, seeing this shit, but, bro. But who's stopping her though? The West is doing their thing, and, and like I just told you, I'm still, uh, I'm still, hey, I'm, hey, salute, coffee. Do you got your own thing going on. I got my. That's all I'm saying, big dog. Just when you're yeah. doing interviews, don't continue to try to attach your name to mine in a negative or you know what I'm saying, like just to you, keep, you don't have to do that because you ain't seeing me saying nothing negative to keep my buzz going. You don't gotta keep saying like nobody would even know you was out the mafia without you telling them. They had just noticed we not together. You jumping on every platform. I, I, I'm not with the mafia, not on the riot, not on the... Bro, I was just with a nigga the other day who was like, oh, I knew I was going to see you at the Queen of the Ring event because Coffee was supposed to battle hustle. I knew you was going to come support. Niggas, niggas, man, niggas don't even know I'm not even rocking with you because I don't go around saying it. Mm. I'm letting... That's all you. If nigga go back from interview, 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 I'm not... I ain't jumped on 15 minutes of fame, did no thousand blog. I ain't been on Hip Hop is Real, did no big blog. I ain't been on my Twitter... Blocking, saying different shit about you. I ain't like this. Is my first time even speaking in this in depth about it, just because at this point it's like, bro, somebody gotta say the truth because it's obviously it done got out of control. You go, you know what I'm saying? Like you got everybody just in a frenzy thinking you saying some real shit when everybody in the culture already really know. But it's like, all right, fuck it. For the fans who's slow and can't see what's going on, you feel what I'm saying? Like, bro, it's not that fucking serious, bro. Mm. I'm talking now. We just take it away from all of that and just say on some gangster shit. If y'all do got beef like that, and is that fucking serious? And is that fucking serious? Then, 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 then why was it? Then why are we doing all this talking on here? Then, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah. If it's yeah. that serious, how many interviews you gonna say about how you gonna do this and do that? If beef is like that, because something happened to either one of y'all on either party, we already know who did it. If it's real beef. It's battle rap beef. Y'all don't want to battle each other, don't battle each other, but don't keep putting me in it because I don't give a fuck if y'all like each other or don't. Okay. You okay. feel me? That's all my whole point is with her. So I salute her. Keep doing what you're doing. Handle your business. You dig what I'm saying? Just okay. don't be saying Gucci Gotti's doing this and doing that because Gotti ain't fucked up no bag for you. Gotti ain't stopped you from doing nothing. When Gotti booked you versus A-Ward, you didn't show up. I didn't go on here and say, oh, this bitch ain't show up, then they fucked up the event. Nigga, the event went fine. It was great. Niggas didn't even notice it didn't happen. We had a good time. Everybody was lit. A-Ward got paid in full, went home. He didn't, I didn't keep his back in. Yo, big dog, she didn't show up. So, you know, that's my money. Nigga, here. And you showed up. You was there, man. Salute, big dog. Hey, appreciate you coming out. Glad you enjoyed the show. Catch you later. We tried to do it the next day. Ask him. I was like, if she's still out here doing, you want to just go to Albo House, one-on-one, -on -one, no crowd, and y'all battle just to, for the footage, y'all can do that. She wasn't there. All right, it's over with. We don't even need to battle no more. Next next, next bag, we on to something else. We ain't even tripping. That's all I'm saying. You feel me? And niggas in the comments is understanding that. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is, people so hyped up on beef and battles, where it's like they want the, like, I'm not I'm not here for that. I'm not here for the it's studio. Not even that. I, I, I want y'all niggas to reconcile, and it really be but about it the Yeah, it, look, it ain't even nothing to reconcile, though. To me, I'll be like, hey, at the end of the day, look, salute, do your thing. Like, everybody, like, always energy. I'm big on energy. 
So if it was something like that, I know that that that, that was that studio that you would sit there and turn that studio situation into this big old thing like that. You know, Compton, I'm really on some like, nah, Crip, I'm I'm mafia. Like, you feel me? Like, on the hood, because this mafia shit real with me too, though. You dig what I'm saying? Like, that shit tatted in my skin. This nigga's on level four prisons, got mafia tatted on. Like, this shit, like, you a part of it on some rap shit. This shit, big dog shit with me, though. You feel me? So, like, when you go against that, that's still, we got rules and regulations. You go against the mafia, you ain't even, you did? Like, that's even off of this camera shit, but just to let it be reaffirmed, like, we don't even play like that. You know what I'm saying? So, we gonna let you do you, and we gonna support your career from a distance. Do what you do. We not even here to hate on you. We not stopping no bags. Like I just told you, you can bring them niggas up here. Tell me if I'm lying on Nettie Block Crip. Ask Debo, did he call me? Hey, is it? No, it's great to book her. Big dog, she's a talent. She has star power. She's great. She's a great rapper. Continue to book her. Don't don't worry. I will still battle on your platform with her there and all that. She's great. Yo, B, she good, man. Let her be a part of tournaments, whatever she want to do. She's good people. She can rap. She's tight to me. Let her do her thing. I'm not no black ball and weirdo. People can't come in venues where I'm at type nigga. I'm a street nigga, man. Get money. I'm getting way too much to even be worrying about whatever little bags y'all getting. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real, though. You know what I'm saying? Yo, DC, you a funny nigga. Contracts, when we get off this shit, you're going to be like, Geech, I ain't know you be getting that for battles. I know you're going to say that. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting that for battles. Been you know what? It for a long time. You know what? On some real shit, right? Boom. This going to be one of them questions. I, I got to ask you if I want to know the real answer to this. When that whole shit was going down with Avocado, right? Yeah. How, like, 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 what was your what was your mind thought? Cause you rock with him, obviously. Yeah, and my thing was this. My thing was this with that. Yeah, a lot of people. That's why I did the interview with him. I talked okay. to him like a man. I said, "Yo, that wasn't mafia. That wasn't cool. You feel me?" But I, but I also, I've been around you in a different light. You know what I'm saying? I've seen you in a different light, man. I know you not no blatant racist. You helping out plenty of people. You shooting videos, you 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 doing blogs, you you doing uh shooting a whole events, doing all this. Most of the time, not even asking for nothing. You doing it out the love of the culture, doing this shit for people of all races, not just black, not just white, Mexicans or whatever. You fucking with motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? You genuinely handle it face on, got on camera and talked about it and said what you had to say. You did what I'm saying. You let people talk crazy about you and you listen and you understood you that you let it happen. So at that point, it's like. Is that a problem? Like, like, okay, are we going to sit there and say a motherfucker ain't made a joke here and there? You know what I'm saying? Okay, don't do that again, dog. We catch you doing that again, big dog. We ain't, you know what I'm saying? Because now that means you haven't grew from that. But if you as a man can say, man, I used to be drinking. I used to be doing a lot of different shit. I, I wasn't in the right state of mind. I probably did let say some shit or I was around people saying some shit. I'm not in that place. I'm on sobriety now. I don't be on that. We can all know a time we wasn't on the type of shit we own. You know what yeah. I'm saying? When niggas done been drunk and did some shit where now you like, man, hell no, nah, I wouldn't do that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, I wouldn't even think like that right now. You know what I'm saying? It's motherfuckers who, who change over time. I'm not saying racism can change, but that that didn't, that little joke didn't entail racism. It more seemed like he was making jokes about the battlers. Mm. You know what I'm mm. saying? Like, nigga, it just so happened he was white. The other nigga 24-7 was more racist. Alvo was laughing. Was wild, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah, Alvo did laugh at the joke, but for the most part, the other shit, okay, shook, fat, da 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 da, -da, -da. Like, nigga, you would make a joke like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. so it's just the fact that he was white, that, that we blew it out of proportion. It was bright time. So it's like, all right, get on him, man. Correct him. That's what racism about. Do y'all, if you want to really end it, you got to correct the motherfucker. Let them know where they was wrong. Make sure they don't do it again. If you're going to just be like, I ain't fucking with you and let them stay racist or however you feel they is, then it ain't going to change nothing. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. Like, if you ain't going to correct the issue, then what's the, what's the reason of even bringing it up? You know what I'm saying? But that's a, mature, that's a mature mindset. Like, in the comments, it's going to be mature, nigga. That's going to be like, Geechee talking real shit. Then it's going to be some weirdos that be like, oh, man, Geechee just saying anything. He, he da, 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 da. They not, you got to have that mindset. You have to bend through something, man. You dig what I'm saying? Everybody ain't really, you know what I mean? Everybody not at that level yet. Angry fan, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Everybody not here. Like, this is, a, this is a different level of, like, you know? Like, and they don't see, they all they see is the violence. They don't be keeping my knowledge, like Bootsy say. When they see me, all they think of is, oh, da, 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 da. They, don't, they don't understand. Like, bro, I'm not no stupid dude. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got a lot of sense, a lot of common sense, too. Street and book smart. I understand both sides of the coin. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not going to get up here and say anything for nothing. Jag, what up? Jag, what up, nigga? Rayvon, what up, nigga? It's real good peoples in there, man. Easy to block him. It's real good peoples in there. And people who done been around me in real life going to tell you it ain't nothing fake, flaw. No, I ain't never did nothing in, in the light that I wouldn't get up here and say right now. Okay. Get anybody, get anybody who done been around. I'm talking about nigga, anybody. You ain't gonna, nigga, ain't gonna, anything I'm saying up here, I done said it to him in person. 
That's why I say them same shit that I said. Anybody, anybody that I spoke on, bring them up here and tell them if I'm lying. If she you. wanted to come up here, if Alvo wanted to come up here, whoever, see if I'm lying. You dig what I'm saying? I'm not finna sit here. Like I say, man, from this point on, I'm glad you asked so it can be done and be done with that, with that question, man. Salute to her. Ain't no issues with me. Enjoy your career, baby girl. All I ask is, when they ask you about me, man, since you don't, I mean, you don't got no issues, no dealings, you don't got to sit there and just be putting no laws on my name saying we did this and did that when that didn't happen. You feel okay. me? I'm not going to sit there and say your name about this and that. I, I ain't said it up until this day. I ain't never gave a fuck about the battle not happening. I ain't tried to reschedule it. I don't really care. It's over with. We on to the next one. Avocado, salute to him. I, I, I talked about it one time. I got a whole podcast with him on there explaining everything. You dig what I'm saying? So people know I still been in business with him. He been in business with everybody else. My whole thing is what I'm laughing at is everybody that was shunned him out at first. Now they back. You feel me? Like if you was going to be that way. Using his talent. <laughs> stay like that the whole time, though. That's my. That's why I don't, I don't do that fake shit. I'm not going to act like I don't like somebody then try to be cool with them later. If I don't yeah. like you, I'm not going to like you. That's it. That's what it is. You yeah. feel me? Don't say you didn't like a motherfucker. Then now, nigga, nigga, back, nigga got the best camera work in the game. We need you on, you know what I'm saying? You don't yeah. use him for like two events because it's hot for niggas. You know what I'm saying? And then now it's back cracking, nigga, all over the world filming black battle rap again. Because, mm -hmm. nigga, you tell me, when first everybody was waiting to see how everybody was going to cancel him out. Once you seen certain motherfuckers were still rocking with him, now niggas is easing back in. That's that weirdo shit. You feel me? Be how you gonna be. You know what I'm saying? Same. It was niggas who probably wasn't fucking with you. They see your platform back booming. You got good interviews going. Yeah, yeah, everybody, yeah, yeah, come yeah. on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Now they low key wanna get on and shit. Yeah. Come on, niggas ready to be back. That's how I don't, I don't move like that, man. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? But like I say, man, if they have been watching, man, the battling been going crazy. The, the career have been skyrocketing. I feel like it's been going great. I feel like I feel like you know I, I've grown as a battler. I've grown as a, a man. You know what I'm saying I'm gonna get married this year. You know what I'm saying my kids. I see the Congratulations. Thank too. you, man. Kids, is, kids is good. You know what I'm saying like I really don't be on no on no drama, man. You know what I mean like I'm kind of just on some like a different trajectory, man. You dig what I'm saying? Where I'm just trying to see things through and manifest my own destiny, man. I ain't really got. I'm, I'm like block. I got the the hater blockers on. I'm not really looking in nobody else's lane. I'm really in mine. You feel, you feel me? So that's why it's easier for me to, to grow. I feel like when you're living like that, you're going to see it. Like, I believe in God so much that I understand that if I'm doing everything right, that he going to give me the blessing that I'm asking for. You did? You know what I'm saying? Like, if I'm not hating on nobody, I'm not blocking nobody else's blessings, then my blessing shouldn't be getting blocked. You feel me? So that's how I'm living my life, man. You don't see me getting up there. I don't get on no interviews down talking nobody. You know, I'm talking about in battle rap. I'm talking about, nigga, after I'm done battling a nigga, you hardly ever even see me recap the battles. I get out there and talk about the win and loss. I'll be done with it. Some of these battlers, they get they talk about the battle for, like, the next six, seven, eight months. Still be on one battle. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I already got paid. I'm done. I look at this shit like a job. When I get paid, and I'm, that's when I talk about you on that stage. After that, next check, nigga. You know what I'm saying? We like, nigga, that one. we off that. that one. We already good. We good, bro. You, man, live your life, big dog, man. I hope you spent that money wisely. Nigga, we on to the next bag, man. They coming so fast. We ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you feel me? My phone was ringing. I had to hang it up, man. That's a bad call, and I'm missing that. But I fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? Let me come talk to Angry Fan. Damn. You know what I'm saying? It's blowing up like that. It's blowing up. You know that, man. You know what I'm saying? So, so question, so get you. So how, how, are we picking our, how are we picking our battles now? Cause you ain't just taking anything no more. I know you're not. Nah, I ain't right, but but nah, nah, I ain't gonna lie. You ain't slowing down neither though. I ain't slowing down. Money either, coming. Though. It ain't broke, so you ain't trying to fix yeah. it. Yeah, and I also look at it like this too, though. When I take battles, a lot of times they'll see me on small leagues with smaller names. Yeah, the month I get paid to do those battles, but also I, they probably, some of those leagues might not have it. You know what I mean, to pay you as much as you would get paid in the big league, which is understandable. But for me, it's like the, the opportunity to touch these platforms and, and meet your fans in the flesh. Because you got to think, a lot of these leagues might be super fans of like a Murder Mook and a Loaded Lux, right? But they might not ever see them. My bad, man. Somebody just called right, right there. You know what I'm saying? Another bag. Another bag. And that one for sure was, right? Hey, but look. <laughs> hey, no, nah, no, nah, for real, for real. Hey, but this all good. They going to tap back in. I'm going to tap in when it's over. But like I say, they might not ever get to see them perform live, you know? The, the uh, caffeine events, like, it, it's, it's been in L.A., it's been COVID, you feel me? They ain't been able to get people in. When you are real, do them big events, them $100, $150 tickets. You dig what I'm saying? 
all that some motherfuckers might not got it. So when you touch a city, you know what I'm saying, you you in these small cities and they get to see their favorite battle rapper and all they got to play, they might be $10, $20 at their door and they leave. You feel me? They might know the nigga at the door and they get to come in. They just, they, they helping, they cooking, whatever. Like that's That means something. You know what I'm saying? You done, you done did yeah. that. Like, you know, that would have did something for me to be able to, as a young nigga being a fan of Pac, to been able to just see him perform. You know what I'm saying? Even though he probably doing big shit at, at fucking the biggest music halls in California, but if he just would have touch one of them hole in the wall spots, nigga, and just wrap some that. shit and rock it. And it's like, damn, I got to meet that nigga. You feel me? That's big. So to me, I try to live that energy as well. Like, let me, I can't go to everyone, but I done touched so many small cities and took pictures with motherfuckers, done got them exchanged contacts and bought they merch, bought whatever food they selling and just, just being being out there with the people. I mm. feel like that's big. That also go in with, with, with being a being your brand. It's like, you can't be out here saying you for the people and you real and all this, and then you, and you can't even just go and, and tap in sometimes, you know what I'm saying, and do this. I'm not saying you can do it all the time, because niggas busy. I, a lot of these battlers is busy. They doing other shit. They working. They got other shit going on, but if it's, if it's an event and I'm open, I'm free, and I can take the battle, I got time, then yeah, I'm going to pull up, man, even if I'm just paid the host. Let me just pull up and fuck with niggas, you know what I'm saying? Like, let me just pop in and see what niggas is on, because you never know, man. Life's short as well, you know what I mean? That might have been their only chance of getting to see a nigga. You dig what I'm saying? So like yeah man like I try to do that. Yeah, get Jag in here, man. Jag is definitely that nigga, man.